All right, another sunny day in White Pine. You can see these snow banks are still pretty high. The shed is slowly coming back out of its hiding. And so I thought it was time for a project out in the shop. No, you silly gooses, we're not gonna work on the Jeep. That project's for another day. Today, we're gonna install a new thermostat on the heater. You may be wondering why I need a new thermostat. I mean, I've got this beautiful Honeywell here taped kind of to the wall with one wire broke off. That's the reason that we're putting a new one on. So here's the re replacement. This is a smart thermostat. Uh, so this one connects to my Wi-Fi and I can download the app and then wherever I'm at, I can turn my heat up and down. So on a nice, cold winter day and I decide I want to work in my shop, I can uh, bump the thermostat up a little bit, let it warm up out here while I'm enjoying a cup of coffee in the house, and then come on out and hit whatever project I'm on in warmth. Okay, so the conduit is run up and over my little opening and then just straight up by the furnace. The wires are just coming out of the top of it. Let's see if you can see it or not. Yeah, you can kind of see them right there, the two black wires. Those are those my friends. So here are the two wires coming in for the thermostat. Into the box. This is the app that you want to get. So just hit get. Okay, so I think it should be installed. So I'm just going to hit open. Okay, it shows a nice, beautiful somebody's house. Go ahead and hit okay. The Honeywell techs are here. They're installing this for me. She's short. So because I was cheap, I didn't actually buy the right color-coded wire. So now we have to kind of oh, pay more wire, attention. Then. Yeah, it's stranded. You have to make sure. Stranded. It. Oh boy. Okay, so this is just before we put the thermostat on. Now it would be awesome because it's all color-coded and labeled really nice, but I didn't buy cable. I had some old communication cable from another project, so I'm using that. Okay, so now you just close this little hatch and install the thermostat. Oh. Okay, just push it on. There it is. That's pretty fancy. But is this the actual temperature outside right this now? This is the app. So where you're located right now, it's 50 degrees and sunny. It's supposed to be a high of 50, low of 28. Okay. This is Sweetie. The sweetie. Thermostat. Sweetie the thermostat, people. <laughs> She's 47 degrees and off. Oh, right all right. Now. So turn it up. So to turn it up, you would. Oops. Okay, sorry. It has to go through its thing. So you would turn mode to heat. Okay. And then 63, 64. All right. So the app is set up the same way. Your thermostat kind of goes dark and will just display the temperature. You tap it, everything comes on. So it's the same mode, fan, schedule would be in menu. So you can also turn it down here and then it'll show on your app that it just went down a degree. Oh, okay, cool. All right, and then show how to shut it off. Then you go from the phone. mode and then off. Go ahead, hit it Do you off. want me actually to shut it off? And now it's back off. So it's back off. So oh, and the furnace just kicked out. Yeah. So the fan will. All right. Mm -hmm. It's really necessary to have a Wi-Fi thermostat that you can take a look at from anywhere. Turn it up and down. No. You can go out there and turn it up and down the old-fashioned way. But I'm gonna do it this way. It gives me some more time to watch some YouTube videos and wait for the shop to warm up. So I hope the uh, video was good. You enjoyed it. And uh, let me know if you got one of these and how it works for you.